officer that said, uh, if there's kids in there, we need to go in there. Another responded, whoever's in charge will determine that. Um, it goes on, we'll get into more of that later, but I know you have part of the timeline of the children who were calling 911 themselves from yeah, inside the room. Absolutely, and you've got a one brave enough to pick up your phone, brave enough to make the call one, two, three, four times, please. Uh, the public is demanding answers, especially the families of those victims. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna have to wait for... Breaking. And you know, in the, in the, I don't know if it's the manual or the charging papers essentially for law enforcement there, it specifically says if you're not prepared to give your life for others, perhaps yes. this is not the right calling for you. And I think unfortunately, you know, despite, or no matter how... Roe versus Wade. Morgan Ortegas. Yes. We cannot tolerate injustice and lack of law and order in this country. It will be beyond chaotic. Well, Tim, I think D.C. itself has gotten better at protecting and hardening buildings. The Supreme Court has been hardened for weeks, and that is due to ongoing threats of violence against the justices. As omnipotent as it is, is to communicate in weapons-grade rhetoric. Chuck Schumer, you've unleashed a whirlwind. You're going to pay. You're not going to... Okay, when they do it, it's politics. When the right does it, as Emily said, it's an insurrection. This is violence. And we can try to protect them. It'd be better if we went after the people who were breaking the law. That way, you could do both. Mm -hmm. All right, just the reporting uh, that Kamala Harris has complained that if she were any of her 48 press, it's it's not white or male. It's a black Indian female in the mirror. Yeah, that's oh. right. And apparently the problem, Joy Reid goes on to say, is that her personality is not being showcased. As she's, second in, she's first in line to the presidency. This is not a job where you get to pick and choose your battles. You don't get to decide what might show up on your desk one day. That's why no one's buying this excuse right. if I have it hard. What they don't tell you about that meet and greet, though, it's 5000 to get in. It's actually 20000 to get out. <laughs> Nobody wants the, to the, the COVID task Sorry. force landed on Vice President Pence's desk. He did it. Than any other generation yeah. to really get aggressive with your kids about not doing drugs, because to be clear, yeah, they good. don't wait in line for Peter Pan sexual. They just want to ride the rides. And who maybe want that break. That's a great point. And then, but Jimmy, for some of those companies that have been hit hard mm -hmm. by COVID restrictions and the oppressive government we're under, uh, they, they're only <laughs> open four days a week. And yep. so that goes